Guilty again. A Grand Junction man whose first murder conviction was overturned has been found guilty a second time in the death of his wife, Jennifer. We were in court as the verdict was read and when Michael Blagg was sentenced. Denver 7's Teresa Marchetta is joining us now. Teresa, he will spend the rest of his life behind bars. Sure will, Ann. And you know what? He's no stranger to prison. Michael Blagg was convicted of killing his wife, Jennifer Blagg, back in 2004. And then a decade later, that conviction was overturned after a judge found out a juror didn't tell the court about her past experience with domestic violence. Prosecutors argued Blagg killed his wife while she was sleeping, then dumped her body in a trash can at work. They used blood and stains in the family's minivan as evidence, but the defense always pointed to a different suspect and said an investigator could have tracked the blood into the car. A former FBI agent even testified, saying he believed a child predator who was going after Blagg's six-year-old daughter killed Jennifer Blagg. Former agent John Larson testified he believed the suspect moved Jennifer Blagg's body to frame Michael Blagg. But in the end, the jury didn't buy it. They found Blagg guilty on all counts. Jennifer Blagg's family says despite this verdict, nothing compares to losing a loved one. This particular situation rearranges a family. Your attitude, your outlook, the way you live your life. And I can say it should. Nothing is ever, ever the same. That is Marilyn Conway, Jennifer's mom, and she also told the judge during sentencing she lost two children at once. She's referring to Blagg's six-year-old daughter, Abby, who disappeared during this investigation, 